Google Workspace users can take advantage of the password recovery option or reset their own password if the administrator has enabled it within the Google Admin Panel. My name is Carlos and today I will show you what you as the administrator has to do to enable this option. Having this enabled will make your life much easier as the administrator and of course easier for the users. It is important to know that users will have to set up a recovery phone number and a alternate email address within their Google accounts before they can actually use it. Here is a video that shows the steps that users need to follow to add their recovery information. As the administrator, you can also add recovery email address and phone number for all the admins and also for users. As an alternative, you can also reset any user password. Let's now jump to our computer and see what you as the administrator needs to do. Since this has to be done within the Google Admin Panel, you will need to have the administrator role. We have accessed our Google Workspace account and then we need to access the Admin Panel. So we click on the upper right corner where we find the nine little dots. Here we will need to find the Admin icon and click on it. And if we want or need to reset any user passwords, we can do it from here. Under Users, we can click on Manage. Here we will find all the users within our Google Workspace account. This is our demo account. We have only two users. And if we scroll over the users, we will find the option Reset Password. Then we click here and we will have two options. We can allow Google Workspace to generate the password or we can create our own password. Then we enter the password and we can use this option to ask the user to change their password when they sign in. From this moment, the user will need to enter their new password to access their account. Now, if we want to enable the self recovery option, we need to go to our menu here on the left and click on security. Or you can also scroll down and find security here. Within the security section, we scroll down and we will find account recovery. And then we click on the little arrow. The section that we are interested in is here, user account recovery. In this case, this option is off and we want to turn it on. Then we need to click on the little pencil and it will display this option that we need to check. Allow users and non super admins to recover their account. And then we need to click on save. From this moment, the option has been saved and is enabled. As we can see, these are simple steps that we need to follow in order to enable the self recovery option for the users. The recovery information helps users access their Google Workspace account when they can't sign in. If you set up a recovery email address and a phone number, it is used to send a code to the user to sign into their account if they are locked out blocks someone from using a user's account without their permission, make it easier for a user to prove that an account is theirs, and tell a user if there is suspicious activity on their account. I hope you find this information useful for your work as a Google Workspace Administrator. If you do, please give us a thumbs up. It helps this video to reach a wider audience. If you have any questions, please leave it here down below. And if you want to see more videos like this one or want to find it easily again in the future, please hit the subscribe button. Thank you and I hope to see you next time.